What if I fail? What if it doesn't work out? What if they don't like me? What if I fail the interview? What if I freeze up? Have you ever noticed that anxiety often begins with a what if question? And not any type of what if question, right? These are negative what if questions. They're not happy, fluffy, positive what if questions. They're those negative ones. What if I fail? Now, when we ask ourselves those negative what if questions, the trap is there's no end to them. There's just more and more negative what ifs. And before we know it, it's like we have dug ourselves into a big black hole of negative what if questions. So the tip for overcoming anxiety and building confidence is to have awareness of it. Have awareness when you're doing this, when you're saying it to yourself. And with that awareness, you can press pause, time out, step back in your mind, and then maybe even ask yourself some positive what if questions. What if this is a great opportunity? What if it's the start of something new and exciting? What if it's the, a chance to test how far I've come? And with that, you take back control. You've got control of what you think. In fact, you're the only one that's got control of what you think. Hey, but don't take my word for it. Take it, put it into action, try it out, and test the difference. Be aware of the what-ifs, put positive what-ifs in, and then gauge how it feels better. Let me know how, how you get on. I'd love to hear from you.